Hey everybody, Mark Treen. Um, just wanted to try to help you guys out a little bit. Um, question came up, how do you put your website so that it shows up on Facebook? Um, I didn't actually know that it did that, but I know how to do it in, in Lightroom. So let me just show you that real quick. So your picture file, whether it's a JPEG or a RAW, has metadata uh, in that file that has all sorts of information about your picture. A lot of it is automatically uh, filed by your camera when you take the picture. But there's other stuff that you can fill in um, when you're importing it or um, a lot of other ways you can do it. Here's a way you can have it be done automatically and put your website in there. So go to the library module, click G or hit library up here under preset go to edit presets and you can just start typing in from the top to the bottom anything that you have selected will become part of the preset so an example would be you don't want to have the preset have the GPS location because every picture has a different GPS location so make sure that's unchecked anything you'd want to have in the preset for importing you'd want to have in here so this is where you would put um, under IPTC creator your website. So just type in your website. If you wanted to put your email in there, I have a text expander so it automatically fills all that in. So just type in your email, your website, whatever else um, you want to have in the preset. So if you don't want that to be in there, then deselect it. I have one that I already have created from uh, some tips I got from somebody else where it has this copyright symbol for 2014. So mine is Mark Copyright 2014. So when you're done with the preset that you've created, the metadata preset you've created, then you would save it and then go to import, put in your, your SD card, all your pictures pop up and you just go over here to apply during import and select that preset that you've just created and now the reason why I said it takes zero effort is because from now on whenever you import pictures as long as that pre-sort preset is selected over here which will it'll automatically be there you don't have to reselect it then all of your pictures will have all that metadata filled in including that website so I hope that helps if you have any questions just um, PM me or, or uh, write a comment with my name in it. I'll get it. Thanks.